I wanted to visit Goa during monsoon for so long so this year I decided to make that happen and book my train to Goa. I booked my stay in Palolem which is in South Goa so I directly headed to the south. On day 1 I went to Bamanbudu waterfalls with some friends I met at my hostel and we decided to follow the water stream So the flow of the water was strong but somehow we managed to wade across and it's definitely one of the stupidest things I've ever done but so much fun The next day we headed to Mainapi waterfall which is located in Netravali Wildlife Sanctuary So you have to do a 4.5 km trek to reach this waterfall and there will be so many leeches waiting to welcome you on the way. After spending one week in South, I headed to North Goa. So while going to the North, I saw this place called Siolim, and it looked so cool. So I decided to visit this place. And to my surprise, there were no tourists at all, and I spent good two hours here. Sunset we headed over to Chapora Chitti beach and it is a perfect spot to watch sunset The next day we decided to visit Para Road thanks to Bollywood movies Para Road became very famous and flooded with tourists But I found another road which is very similar to Para Road with no people and it lies right beside the Para Road
also visited fountain has which is the oldest latin quarter in goa and here you will see all the colorful old houses and the portuguese influence in the architecture Our last stop on this trip was Palolem so we headed back to South Goa and drove to Kaboderama beach. Then we walked on to the spot where there was no one and ended our last day in Goa with a beautiful sunset. <laughs> 